FAQ. Testing a simple UHF data receiver module. Is it sensitive and selective enough to pick up amateur signals on 433 MHz? Keep watching and find out. Here's a quick look at the circuit. Really simple, just the UHF 433 MHz data module. The output or the data out goes to a 10k potentiometer and then a standard LM386 audio amplifier circuit. I'm powering the whole thing off 5 volts or 4 AA rechargeable batteries. This is it inside, the speaker to the left, the receiver module to the right and at the top of the picture the LM386 audio amplifier built dead bug style. As you can hear, it's a strong signal, even with only half a watt of AM. Of course, a broadband receiver on 433 MHz is likely to pick up a lot of interference. It's a popular frequency used by a lot of low power devices. And super regen receivers aren't exactly the most selective. But on the bright side, these little transmitters only use a few milliwatts to non-gain antennas, if any at all. Whereas amateurs can use many watts and gain antennas. So despite the interference, you should be able to get quite good distances with this simple receiver. By the way, I tried this with a narrowband FM signal, but the signal was very faint. You could hear the carrier, but the modulation was almost nothing. With wideband FM, it would probably be okay. As for SSB, well, you could resolve something if you are able to get another low power transmitter to act as a BFO. This has been a brief test, but it's proved that even with half a watt of AM from an FT817, this thing can clearly hear the signal 800 metres away. And if using even a modest gain antenna, it's likely to overpower other low power signals in the 433-434 MHz region. I wouldn't be surprised if this could pick up amateur signals 20 or 30 kilometres away or more.